instead of walking from Land's End to John O'Groats. I've been walking in every single county of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. I've been walking in campuses within schools, colleges and universities. So this is about the 140th college I've been to. And every day I meet young people and I walk with young people. Every component of the charity is a gift so I don't have to fundraise for it. And the other thing I don't do is don't ask the public for any funding. I, w I, I want to help other charities, not compete with other charities. Um, the cost of the centre is £15 million pounds, and I've got to find a way without any staff to raise the money um, in, in, without asking the public, which is quite a big, it's a big thing. The area I, I work in is, is young people between 16 and 25 post-trauma. Um, young people who are having such a tough time because of something that's happened to them with a disability or medical condition or deprivation or young carers that they can be in quite a low place which can lead to depression and self-harm. A mile of walking is equivalent to three to four miles for someone without a spinal cord injury. I do about six or seven miles a day, uh, which is a marathon distance a day. So at the end of the year when I finish in Canary Wharf just before Christmas, um, that's 310 marathons in 330 days.